A staple restaurant in Painted Post will be closing its doors this weekend after more than 70 years of business. That's right, and our very own Isabel Garcia spoke with a family who ran the diner for generations. She joins us now live in the studio with more information behind the decision to close. Isabel? Nick, Logan, Rambler's Rest on Victory Highway and Painted Post will be closing for good on Saturday. It was all the way back in the late 1950s when things first got started, initially as a hot dog and hamburger stand. My parents bought the restaurant in 1957. It was just a seasonal thing. They were open from April to October because there was no heat. It was a dirt floor. They basically, the only heat they had was a charcoal grill that was a real charcoal grill. From a small drive-in hot dog stand to a classic American diner, Rambler's Rest has become a known staple in the Painted Post community. And as the restaurant expanded over the years, so did the sense of family. It's always been a family business. My children have all worked here. My <laughs> granddaughter, who is her daughter, her name is Cooper. She's going to be 13 next week. She's come in and waited on people and taken money. And so it's been three generations. I've had people watch me grow up and I've watched other kids come in and, and see them grow up. And it's just... It's a lot. It's, it's not really like hitting me until right, <laughs> right now. Um, I didn't think I was going to miss it, but I really, I really think I will. I started when I was in high school, which I graduated in 68, so I've been coming ever since then. Yeah, I've been coming since I was about 13 or 14 years old, and I've been retired eight years, so it's been a long time. <laughs> and a final message to all of the customers, something difficult to summarize. I haven't got enough words to say. Um, I have thanked and thanked and hugged and kissed and cried. My, some of my customers have cried. We've gotten some beautiful thank you notes, how much they're going to miss us. And I can't thank them enough for over 50 years of coming in here and being our family and our friends. Rambler's Rest will officially close at 1.30 p.m. on Saturday. Serview Bank purchased the property and will be building a branch there. The Rambler's Rest family will be moving to a new home on the river and are looking forward to spending time with their four kids and nine grandchildren. For now, reporting in the studio, Isabel Garcia, WENY News.